Well, hello everybody. Welcome to all trade bait all the time video trade package. Yeah, I'm going to show a trade package. I haven't done this before. Maybe I've seen other others of you probably out there are doing that, but I haven't made a video yet with a trade package. So there won't be a lot of surprises all because it's probably going to be majority Dodgers because that's what I collect, right? But there are always nice surprises nonetheless for those of us who love Dodger cards and those of us who just love plain old baseball cards anyway, right? It's always good to see an attractive card unless it's from the Giants or the Astros. All right, that said, beer review today also to go along with our beers. This is Elliot. Elliot from Ex Novo Brewing Company. Ex Novo. They're out of uh, Portland, Oregon. All right. So this is an IPA. I've never had anything from them before. And I'm looking forward to tasting it. We had an IPA yesterday that was pretty good. Today's IPA comes in at 6.6 .6 ABV. And something that I saw that was very interesting about Ex Novo that I'm glad I read the info on the can. Ex Novo donates 100% of their profits to what they say are organizations helping to make a better world. All right, it doesn't give a list, but I suppose you could go to their website if you feel cynical about their claim. But for me, it's good enough and it sounds good enough and I'll take them for their word that they are giving their proceeds of their pro profits which if I was brewing this beer the proceeds of the profits would probably first buy me a brand new car <laughs> but they're putting their proceeds into what they say is making the world a better place and so because of that bravo ex novo right on very glad to meet your beer and hope it tastes good and if it do, I'll be sure to tell everybody out there to go and get beer from Ex Novo. Here we go. Let's try it out. Opening pour. Looks like an IPA. Here we go. Mm -hmm. And boom. All right, mm, I can smell it from here. It's a big, fresh IPA, citrusy, hoppy. Hmm. Fresh spring beer smell. I like it. Now let's have a taste. Oh boy. Hmm. Orange, tangerine, um, uh, maybe another kind of citrus. I almost want to say a hint of kumquat in there. This is very tasty. Ex Novo. Way to go. This is a very good IPA. It gives you just a nice round of hops. It doesn't overpower you. And then it finishes off the second half of the taste is that that wonderful citrus flavor. Yeah, it's a blend of, of different citrus fruits. I'm loving this beer. Right on. Very good. Elliot, ex novo, out of Portlandia. Go get this beer from this company. Try something else. I'm definitely going to try something else from them the next time I see their beer. So bravo to them. Okay, here we go. Trade package. This comes from Tom Tessier. Tessier, forgive me, Tom. First time I say your name out loud. I'm not. I'm not sure how to pronounce your last name, but I hope I didn't butcher it too much. Tom runs the blog. Um, oh, suddenly it, it, the name escapes me. It's about angels, though. It's it's uh, angel centric baseball card collector. So um, give Tom's. Oh boy, maybe the name. Angels in Order. That's the name of Tom's blog. Go see Angels in Order. 
and you'll see a great blog about California Angels. Not LA Angels cards. All right, let's see what Tom sent me. Whoa, see, as I said, surprises do abound, even in a trade package. First card up I see, what do you see? Remember how I said, we're probably going to see baseball cards. Well, check that out. What does the note say? Good luck with collecting. Good luck with collecting hockey too. All right. So, and one nice thing. Now, see you folks that aren't, <clears throat> I don't blog or you're perhaps new to the blogging world, trading world, uh, baseball card trading and so on. If you've ever wondered about it also now's my chance to let you know it's it's great the blogging baseball card collecting trading community is full of great folks tom being one and being a great example and see how everything comes in this nice padded envelope and this is a good decent way normal perfectly normal way to pack a bunch of cards you just put it in what they call a team bag here like so it's thick enough that it doesn't require to be like in a box or something like that they are all uniform size and it's thick enough so that they're pretty solid as a unit in shipping plus two uh, proper envelope and your cards will be good to go speaking of good to go once again Elliot which uh, apparently they named after their neighborhood so great beer wow I love it I love this beer <clears throat> good luck with collecting hockey all right so let's see what did he send me check this out look at this I'm gonna look at that in a minute actually okay so here comes some hockey cards what have we got we've got LA Kings so I just recently got into collecting hockey and collecting of course the homeboys from LA the Kings let's check them out Steve Duchesne Tony Granado. This might well be maybe the team set. It looks like a whole fistful of them. Look at this. Look at this. If it's not the team set, it's pretty darn close. What have we got? I'm going to show you right here. Look at this. I can do like a, I can do like a freaking card dealer. Look at this. Here's a. Here's how you send a fistful of cards to somebody. <laughs> Wow, that's a lot of cards. Thank you, Tom. Look at all these kings, L.A. kings. Boom. Pick a king, any king. All right, look at that. Who else have we got? Tom Laidlaw coming off of a slap shot. John Tonelli. I'm going to flip through these a little bit fast, but uh, enough that uh, Kelly um, Hudley, if you see my, uh, if you see this video, then you'll see that I gave your card enough respect and time, screen time. Just like this guy. Who's that man? Luke Robotai. He was hot stuff. Um, Dave Taylor. So these are um, not quite vintage kings, but back. It's already starting to be back in the day kings when these guys played. Tomas Sangstrom. I watched a lot of these games of these boys here. Tim Waters. Oops. Mike Krusenilski. I didn't watch enough to remember how to pronounce everyone's name the best though. Steve Casper. These are great cards. These are score cards. Larry Robinson. I remember Larry. Look at that nice horizontal shot there. Marty McSorley. Everybody loved McSorley. We love to see him get down. Todd Elick. Brian Benning. Rob Kozlowski. Here's Luke in motion. There's a very sweet card, right? Luke with the vapor trails behind him. There you go. Robitaille. He left many an opponent seeing him like this as he zipped around them with the puck. Rob Blake. There we go. What a nice batch. Great batch of kings. Good starter set. Thank you so much, Tom. These are great. Let's see who else have we got. We got some more, a few more uh, hockey. Daryl Sidor there. Guy, Guy Levine. All right, look at this. He dropped in Raiders. Look at Tom gave me a little bit of everything here. So that's why I say there's always surprises. Even though it's an individual package for an individual collector, you're always going to find nice surprises in what your trade partners send to you. All right, so here we go. Bam. 
Mari Cooper from the Raiders. Very cool. We got um, Cordiel Patterson. He's in the different uniform because he's been traded over. Okay, how about some? How about some Rams? And I'm also a Ram fan. Of course, I was a Ram fan since I was a kid, right? Duvall love there. Raiders. Kenny King. I used to see Kenny King play back at the Coliseum. I think that's a shot of him at the Coliseum. As a matter of fact, um, who else have we got here? Darren McFadden coming up. Look at that. These are sweet cards. This is. These are great. Who else have we got? Todd Gurley. Look at that, huh? Very nice. We got the running back, Todd Gurley. That's great. Another very cool card of Luke Robitaille. Here we go. Luke. Look at that. There's some beautiful cards in here. What have we got? Peter Arola. Look at this puppy. Look at that. I don't know if the video will do it justice. It's a little too reflective. But it's like a hologram. And there's a hologram of him in there. Can you see that? Look at that. Whoa, that's a beauty. That's a great card. What else have we got? If you're going to have Raiders, you got to have. Boom, Bo, baby. Got to have Bo. All right, now, last few cards. Let's take a swig of this wonderful beer. I can't say enough. It's very tasty, but also the second half is let's, let's support Ex Novo Brewery. Buy a sixer. Try it out. I recommend the IPA. If you see another um, another style that they make, uh, it looks like they know what they're doing. So try out try out a different style. But let's support them because they're making the world a better place. And I like when every time we drink beer, the world not only looks a little better, but it really might be getting a little better. Here, here. Here we go. Let's see a few Dodgers. Jock Peterson. Rich Hill, he of the blister. You can almost see the end of his finger coming off in this one. Senor Puig, I love it. Puig is heating up at the right minute. The Dodgers are heating up very nicely at the right, at the right time right now. Here's Grandal, the bat drop king. Look out for Yaz. Here we go. Kershaw, you got to have Kershaw all the time. See how beautiful these cards are, right? Great, great shot there of Kershaw. I love it. Here we go. Here's Jock again. I think this is Jock on opening day of last year when he hit that grand slam. I think that is what this shot is. Clayton Kershaw and a beautiful night card there with the Dodgers bullpen behind it. Um, pretty sure that Night Owls already got this one, but there's a beautiful night card, right? And Mr. Utley, the man, they love him down here. All right, so Chase Utley still doing very well. Now, a final little surprise packet here. What have we got? It says Hall of Famers and Dodgers. And if you ever want to send me cards, that's what I like. Baseball cards of Hall of Famers and Dodgers. Let's see what we got here. I already see Johnny B. Oh, these are like stamps. Cool, these are stamps. All right, so let's take these out. Let's get these babies out. Whoa, there's a whole bunch of them flying around. There's some loose ones. Let's see who we've got. Oh, I love it. Look at these are stamps. Here's, I believe this is Robin. I believe this is Robin Yount. They don't give us names, so I'm going to have to guess. Let's see how, how good I am. Robin Yount, of course, Hall of Famer. Hall of Fame, no question. Um, see, oh boy, is this George Brett? I'm going to guess this is George Brett. Here's where all of a sudden I'm making a video and all of my weaknesses are going to shine for everyone to see. I can't recognize vintage guys without their name on the card. We'll see. Here we go. See, I don't know. Yuri Guriel? I don't know. <laughs> I know this guy. This is... Who's that? You tell me. Looks like Nolan Ryan. Who's this? No name tells me. Rod Carew. Hall of Fame, baby. This is a march of the Hall of Fame. Who else have we got? Mr. Pete Rose. Hit King. Pete Rose playing with the Phillies, all right. And we got, how about this? Here's a very nice twin stamps bonded together. Johnny B and Fernando. 
this is a beauty right here this is great and I love that these two these two guys are paired who else have we got uh, let's go to the Red Sox and look at mr. Williams is there somebody else in this picture I don't know here we go let's look at Dave Winfield go Yanks not really <laughs> who else have we got the Garv all right throw a Dodger at me Steve Garvey here's Pete Rose again maybe that's his son Orlando Rose <laughs> and finally we got uh, help me out is it the Sarge I think it's the Sarge please don't hate on me if I got it wrong I didn't grow up a pirate fan <laughs> Thank you so much, Tom. I love these stamps. I happen to even have like a little small stamp book collector um, binder booklet thingy that's been sitting around waiting for just such an occasion. And now these puppies are going to fill in that little stamp booklet. So that's great. I have to try to figure out a way how am I going to store my Fernando stamp and... Uh, Fernando and Johnny B and not split them up hopefully I can do that all right thanks everybody for watching uh, great beer great cards great trade package um, you know it's I just may do more of these trade package openings because uh, sometimes I'm just not in the mood to tape I mean rather type I don't want to type a thousand words but I'll speak them all right see you next time peace